So now let's talk about how to concatenate NumPy arrays. So as you can see here, we have defined a matrix, a two by three matrix. And also here we have defined a one by three matrix. As a matter of fact, this is a row vector. And suppose that I want to add this row to this matrix and build something like this. So that's very easy. In order to do so, I can simply type np.concatenate because I want to concatenate these two arrays and I can pass them in a tuple, so you can see this is a tuple. So I want to concatenate x and y, and I should pass x is equals to zero because I want to add this row vector as a new row to this matrix. So x is equals to zero means row. So we want to concatenate these two arrays, and we want to stack them in row manner. I mean, I want to add this row to this matrix. So we are adding a row. And after doing so, I want to store the result in a variable, let's say called result. And now I want to print the result variable. And if I run a code, you can see here is the result, which you can see that we have concatenated these two arrays in row manner. I mean, row-wise concatenation. But now let's take this example. As you can see now, y is a column-wise vector. So you can see that's a column-wise vector. So now suppose that I want to add this column to this matrix. So in order to do so, I want to concatenate x and y, but in column-wise manner. I mean, the column-wise concatenation. So I should pass x is equals to 1. So now if I run a code, you can see that we have added this vector, I mean this, this column, to the matrix X. But now let's talk about two important notes. And the first note is you cannot pass these values as, for example, 7 and 8 like this. Because here, X is a two-dimensional array, but Y is a one-dimensional array. So it is not possible to pass these values because one of them is a two-dimensional array and the other one is one-dimensional array. So if you run the code, you will get error. So this was the first note. So remember that if the X is a two-dimensional array, then Y should also be two-dimensional array. And note number two is you can pass multiple arrays to the concatenate function in order to concatenate multiple arrays. So for example here, suppose that I want to concatenate X, Y, and also Y again. I mean, I want to concatenate and add this column to this matrix twice. So now if I run the code, you can see that here is matrix X. And also we have added this column twice. You can see one and two. So you can see that we have added this column twice. And also the final note is instead of using the tuple in order to pass these arrays, you can, for example, pass a list of arrays as well. So now if I run the code, you can see that we get the same output. Now I really suggest you to watch this video which is on the screen now.